Oh, no, is it serious? I'd say. Never saw a worse case in my life. What is he have? A terminal case of jerk-itis. It stems from a complete lack of respect for his employees and the inability to use his brain. <gasps> it's in his brain? Oh, my God! How long does he have? She's joking, Patsy. <laughs> I knew that. My cousin had jerk-itis, and he just had to take an antihistamine. Ladies, ladies, don't you get it? It's all about respect. Hey, am I the only one who works? 
works there. Somebody get the phone! Okay. Hello? Colette call from New York Penitentiary? <laughs> She's got too many to keep track uh -huh. of. Hey, weren't you oh, up this so week? Funny. Uh -huh. I'm really starting to worry about her. She just goes from uh -huh. one loser to the next. Uh -huh. Clearly codependent. Uh huh. Mom. Well, gotta go now. I'm working. See you soon. Love you, bye. Does he really worth waiting for? Well, when does he get out of prison? He's the best. He's from New York, you know. Do it. No way! I can't. 
Hey, Mr. Spitz, could you? <laughs> Why, I'd be happy to. I'm always curious about these things and what they say. I often feel like peeking at them, but that wouldn't be right. I took an oath, you know. I could get thrown in jail for opening a telegram that wasn't addressed to me. Yes, sirree, that there would be what the guys in Washington would call a, a federal office. So don't think that I would ever look at someone else's mail because I just wouldn't. All right, already. What does it say? You made it, Rhonda. They want you to come right away. It said they had a job for you all lined up singing in some swoozy nightclub. Where at? Oh, I don't remember. I was reading it at the stoplight at 4th and Locust, and some guy rear-ended me, and, well, it's just a small fender bender, but uh, I did spill some coffee on it. Give me that now. Maybe. No. What? What is it? What does it say? Oh, just an end to a dream, that's all. I got a job waiting for me. The only problem is they thought I was a trio. The photo I sent was kind of blurry, so they don't want Rhonda solo, and I can't possibly come up with two other singers, so... I guess it's over. Looks like I'll be slinging hash in this joint for the rest of my natural born life. Uh, hey Rhonda, I know two really great singers. Really great. Who? That, that's really sweet of you guys, but really, it's not as easy as you may think it is. Audiences can be really tough. And besides, I can't see either one of you being able to tell Mo you quit. You're both really wonderful, and I love you, but quite frankly, you just don't have the guts to do it. What is going on out there? I'm sick of this lounging about on the talk bit. Your time here is my time. So just think of it like this. I own you. Get busy.